Nesbitt's inequality says that for any positive numbers a, b, and c, the following holds a over b plus c plus b over c plus a plus c over a plus b is greater than or equal to 3 over 2. In this video, we'll use two methods to prove Nesbitt's inequality. First, we'll use the AMGM inequality, and then we'll prove it again using the Cauchy-Schwarz inequality. Let's begin with the first method, using the arithmetic mean geometric mean inequality, or AMGM. To make the expression simpler, let's introduce some variables. We'll let x equal a plus b, y equal b plus c, and z equal c plus a. We want to prove the inequality in terms of these new variables. Let j represent the original inequality. Now, consider the following expression, which we'll call k. k equals z plus x over y, plus x plus y over z, plus y plus z over x. Next, we apply the AMGM inequality to each term in k. The AMGM inequality tells us that the arithmetic mean of a set of non-negative numbers is greater than or equal to their geometric mean. k is greater than or equal to 6. Now, we relate k to j. We have k equals 2 times j plus 3. Since k is greater than or equal to 6, we get j is greater than or equal to 3 over 2. Let's move on to the second method, the Cauchy-Schwarz inequality. We start by expressing j again in its original form. To apply Cauchy-Schwarz, we rewrite each term like this. a over b plus c equals a plus b plus c minus b plus c all divided by b plus c. This simplifies to a over b plus c equals a plus b plus c over b plus c minus 1. We do the same for the other terms, which gives us j equals a plus b plus c over b plus c minus 1 plus a plus b plus c over c plus a minus 1 plus a plus b plus c over a plus b minus 1. Now, we factor out a plus b plus c, giving us j equals a plus b plus c times 1 over b plus c plus 1 over c plus a plus 1 over a plus b minus 3. Now, we apply the Cauchy-Schwarz inequality. Cauchy-Schwarz tells us that 1 over a plus b plus 1 over b plus c plus 1 over c plus a times a plus b plus b plus c plus c plus a is greater than or equal to 9. j is greater than or equal to 9 over 2 minus 3 which simplifies to j is greater than or equal to 3 over 2. And that completes the proof using Cauchy-Schwartz. Thank you for watching. Be sure to subscribe for more math videos.